Vikings Real Life Partners 2021 Revealed. Hello and welcome back to Afcam Celebs. For today's video, we are going to talk about the Vikings Real Life Partners 2021 Revealed. Does Gustav Skarsgård have a secret girlfriend? What kind of pain did Jonathan Rhys Myers and his wife choose not to hide from the press? Why does Alexander Ludwig seem to date solely his co-stars? Keep watching this video to find out the answers to such questions. Let's get started! Catherine Winnick asked Lagerta. Given her reluctance to dish the deeds of her love life, it's no surprise that we don't know much about Catherine Winnick's love life. But that doesn't mean we're totally in the dark. Way back in 2015, Catherine was briefly linked to Sofia Vergavar's ex, Nick Loeb. And although she and Nick denied the rumors, the media and many of the actress's fans were disappointed that it was a false alarm. Since then, the on-screen Shield Maiden has been understandably tight-lipped about any potential romance in her life. Or at least, she was until earlier this year in a surprise move about four months ago. The actress posted a picture of herself with businessman and suspected boyfriend Micah Purcell. And while she hasn't officially commented on her relationship, it seems most of her fans are just happy that she's happy, of course. There are still those hoping that the amazing chemistry between Catherine and her on-screen hobby Travis Fimmel will spill over into real life. But we're not so sure while the actress has the strict and described their on-screen relationship as the ideal love match. She's addicted to off-screen for her co-star is a little too fond of pranks for her to let her guard down. Around him, although with her black belt, to Taekwondo, we're pretty sure even Travis wouldn't prank her. But whatever the truth behind her relationship is, we're just glad she's happy. Gustav Skarsgård as Floki The eyeliner-loving boat builder may have lost the love of his life in the fourth season of Vikings. But for the actor behind Floki, things aren't much better in the romance department. If you thought Catherine Winnick was good at keeping her relationship under wraps, then Gustav must be a pro between 1995 and 2005. Gustav was in a serious relationship with a fellow Swede, Hannah Alstorm. The pair met and they worked together on a television show called House of Shadows in 1999. The couple tied the knot at the ceremony attended by over 200 guests, many of whom were surprised to hear that the couple happy lived had filled for divorce. Just a few years later, however, their breakup seems to have been amissable. The actors have no kids and after their split, no drama either since then Gustav has either been single or has been seriously sneaky about any partners. Nevertheless, there has been unconfirmed rumors that actor is actually in a relationship with a Sweden model and actress called Caroline Drostrom. So accompanied him to the premiere of his brother's Alex film, Tarzan. Despite appearing together at the event, neither has confirmed if there are more than friends. A cursory glance at their respective social media accounts also leaves us in the dark and front Gustav's Instagram and filled with only work of projects and little poetry. But until we hear more about the leading lady in Gustav's life, we're just holding thumbs for a happy ending. Jonathan Rhys Myers as Bishop Hedmund. He may play a bishop on screen, but Jonathan Rhys Myers is no saint. Sadly, he's appeared in the media several times for all the wrong reasons. The actor has admitted that he has a problem with alcohol, especially following a string of arrest for being under the influence. However, it seems that his family may be a thing that turned him around. Jonathan was in a relationship with a makeup artist called Rena Ham from 2004 to 2012 and many fans blame their breakup on his addiction during their relationship the actor was sent to rehab three times luckily he soon met the woman that would change everything it seems that around 2015 the actor started dating american film producer mara lane but the couple never officially announced that they were together that appears to be a theme in their relationship at their engagement was also never officially verified 
married. In fact, Mara only admitted that they were engaged and married a full year after the ceremony in 2017. But that's not all they were sneaky about. In December 2016, they welcomed their son, Wolf, to the world. Although we don't know what inspired the name, you had to admit that Wolf has a decidedly Viking ring to it, doesn't it? Em? Well, Mara has been an amazing partner to the Irish actor, staying by his side and supporting him through his addiction. These two haven't had the easiest relationship last year. Jonathan admitted to the Irish Independent that I'm such a happier than I have been a child gives you a new perspective on life. Unfortunately, behind his comments of how much his joy his son brings to his life, Jonathan is his wife with very sadly not been able to recreate that joy. In 2017, Mara posted a message on Twitter detailing her and her husband's devastating loss. She had suffered a miscarriage with their second child. She admitted that allowing the world to share their news would provide insight into Jonathan's depression and help the couple grieve hopefully. They'll be able to heal from this devastating loss to a happy and healthy family. Raga Ragnars as Queen Gunhild. The actress isn't actually related to Ragnars Lothbrok in real life, but in despite her name, her role as her daughter-in-law, Raga started off her career as an Olympic swimmer, making her debut at the 2004 Summer Olympics when she was just 19 years old after competing again in 2008. She retired four years later when she found out that she was pregnant. Thereafter, she decided to try acting and took a few courses with the New York Film Academy, graduating in 2015. And if you think that's a pretty strange career path, you're not alone. Raga admit that acting has always been a passion. I have had while and as was swimming, acting was always in the back of my head. And she's obviously talented since her first ever role was playing Gun Healed later that the year in Vikings. Not only does she have a really impressive career but Raga is also a mom. However, this lady keeps her family life well away from the limelight. All we know of her is that she was married to the Icelandic businessman called Atli Jarnison from 2013 to 2017. Since then, Raga seems to be focusing on only one man that matters, and it is her son. Who knows, maybe she'll find her own leading man sometime soon. Alex Hoag Anderson as Ivar the Boneless. Like Raga, Alex's part on the Vikings as Ivar was first hit acting job of the Danish actor may be the new show business, but he's giving it it everything he's got, which means that no time for romance or school as he dropped out to start acting. Sure, there were rumors linking him and Catherine Winnick as the two seem really close on set, but that's just Hersey and the actors have admitted that they're just friends. In fact, Alex seems to be too busy for a girlfriend when he's not acting. He's actually behind a camera working on his photography career. And being in Vikings has given him quite a bunch of material for his shots. The actor admitted, I know they have a very strict policy regarding that, but I didn't give a damn. And they ended up liking a lot of my photos. I was just asked by the production if they could get some of my photos for PR. Another of Alex's passion is philanthropy. Between trips around the world to educate people about conservation. He's also a Red Cross Youth Ambassador. And while all these commitments probably mean he doesn't have time for a girlfriend, there has been speculation that one of his models, Ricky Westy, may be more than just a friend. But until we know for sure, we'll hold back on making any assumptions. Marco Ilso as Vitserk. Like his on-screen brother, Marco is a Danish actor, but unlike Alex, he's no stranger to show business. The actor's first ever role was the lead in the Danish TV series, which he begged when he was just 14. With no acting training and this seemingly natural talent, help him land on the part of Ragnar's son on Vikings. Although he's admitted that it's been a role of a lifetime, it meant that he had to spend 
spent three months at a time away from his family and girlfriend. And that's pretty tough. While he's willing to admit that he doesn't have being a part of his lady love, that's all about he will say about her seriously. Not only he not confirmed her name or what she does. But they aren't any pictures of him with a girlfriend on his social media. However, his Instagram account does feature the other love of his life, animals. Okay, we're not so secretly hoping that perhaps his girlfriend is a vet and the lovebirds are destined for a life filled with every kind of pet you can imagine. But I guess we'll have to wait and see if that's the case. Jordan Patrick Smith as Ube. This character may be in a relationship with a shield maiden, Torvi, but Jordan first fell for a different Viking star in 2017. An Irish actress called Sophie Vavasur, featured in two episodes of the hit drama and despite not having a scene with Jordan, the two somehow met and fell for each other. Last year, the actor even surprised his girlfriend with a romantic birthday picnic on the beach. Much to the envy of his female fans, but since that birthday, things have changed for the actor. Earlier this year, Jordan seems to have found a new love as his social media is ablaze with images of Emily Wetzel. She's an entrepreneur and marketer and while we don't know how they met, they are totally into each other. And we love it. Apart from looking adorable together, these two sparked a bunch of rumors when she posted a pic of them together with a cat about her hobby. Despite many fans asking what was up, neither Jordan nor his boo have confirmed anything. We're thinking this may be just a semantic thing as Emily's finger is lacking a little something that would confirm it until there's a ring. We're pinning this down to a rumor so no pressure, Jordan. Alexander Ludwig as Braun Ironside who have saved the best for last, Ragnar's original mini-me and the heartthrob extraordinaire, Jorn. But not thus he gets many ladies' hearts racing, but he seems to be developing a habit of dating his co-stars. When he was 18 in 2008, he dated his race, to which mountain co-star Anna Sophia Rob. For three years then, in 2012, he was linked with his Hunger Games co-star, Levin Rambin. So when he started dating his Viking co-star Christy Dawn this more in 2017 it seems to just his patterns while they were dating. The actress who played a shield maiden called Emma featured heavily in Alexander's social media and they seem to be really happy together but all that changed this year was he met Lauren Deer. Surprisingly neither Alexander nor Christy confirmed their split so fans were a little confused when the actors started sharing some pretty cute pics of his new boo and it was aimed of his love fest and alexander proposed last month that the couple shared a pic announcing their engagement and the internet went wild and a little heartbroken if we're honest and while it's genuinely sad that alex is officially off the market we can't wait to see the pics from the wedding hopefully we don't have to wait that long now, which Vikings cast member has won your heart? And whose relationship is your favorite? Please let me know by leaving a comment below. And if you enjoyed this video, please press the like button, turn on the notification bell, and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thank you for stopping by to watch. See you on our next video.